Street Racer Character Profile, Snotrod. Nowadays, he's referred to as Snotrod, and that started back in his youth. As a kid, he was very sickly, but always soldiered on. He was bullied quite a lot as a kid, but Snotrod was always able to handle himself. Sometimes he would overreact in retaliation, and that would lead to trouble. Snotrod couldn't stay out of trouble, but many knew it wasn't his fault. Snotrod struggled through school, but got through with a few qualifications in mechanics. He struggled to find work as he entered his 20s, he even considered joining the army in an engineering role. But on a positive note, he was a bit of a party goer and was much better at making friends and staying out of trouble. That all went away until he bumped into DJ. Literally, Snotrod bumped into DJ as he was carrying some expensive equipment. DJ didn't fall and nothing was broken, but there was a brief exchange of strong words. Boost saw this, stepped in and calmed everything down. He took one look at Snotrod and immediately took him in. Snotrod was a troubled person and Boost knew how to look after a friend. Boost then introduced Snotrod to the world of drag racing. It was just another party for him until he saw a particular muscle car lining up to race and fail as the lights went green. Snotrod had an idea and took advantage of the opportunity that presented itself. Snotrod wanted to look under the hood and help out. After a few moments, he got in the car and gave it a test drive. The muscle car was working again, but Snotrod wouldn't get out. He demanded a drag race as reward for his efforts. The owner reluctantly agreed and the race took place. Snotrod won, but drove to where the owner couldn't get his car back. Chaos ensued for a few minutes before Boost, DJ and Wingo each challenged the muscle car owner's crew to an ultimate pink slip. A six car race, and if anyone from their crews wins, they keep the muscle car. Needless to say, Snotrod got a new car that night, and one he got to keep.